Hi, we're at uh, GSI in the Mechanical Test Lab. We'd like to talk to you about a grab tensile test of geotextiles. And this is ASTM D as in David 4632. First thing you need to do is prepare the specimen. And that's typically done with uh, steel dies on a uh, clicker press. You would like to cut out specimens that are 100 millimeter by uh, 200 millimeter in length. So it's a uh, four by eight inch uh, rectangular specimen. These are the non-woven, these are the woven. The woven, it's very important that you orient the, uh, the direction of the uh, fibers. You can see that they're uh, very much aligned in, in this case, in the machine direction, and it's also marked. The grips that you're using, uh, these are Instron grips, but they're very important, the chuck that you have in it, which is uh, one inch by two inch chuck, which is uh, 25 millimeters by uh, 50 millimeters. These uh, chucks have different surfaces associated with them. This is a, a serrated steel, and this particular one is a rubber face. Uh, you'll uh, go back and forth with that and uh, try to maximize the uh, face to the geotextile. It's by no means uh, standardized in the standard. This, uh, the grip separation is uh, three inches or 75 millimeters, and the speed is 12 inches per minute or 300 uh, millimeters per minute. You're on a continuous rate of extension. You're gonna measure load off of the load cell and deflection is off of uh, the machine's crosshead travel. This is all set up and ready to go. This is the non-woven textile. We will uh, start the, app, the test. You see this big Poisson effect, and then uh, you'll see rupture of the material. You should have a uh, rupture between the faces, and uh, here it occurred right down at this uh, point here, the low. I'll stop this. Uh, this is the type of failure that occurred. You uh, grabbed it, there was no grip slippage, and uh, this particular test gave uh, me 103 pounds. The deflection here was 2.1 inches, and that corresponds to 70% uh, elongation. You take the 2.1 divided by three to get that percent, uh, percentage of 70%. Uh, so that was the non-woven textile. We're uh, returning the grips, and I'll run the uh, woven. Here you see the orientation of the specimen. You need to uh, center that. And we're ready to go again. Here, moving up, no slippage. These are rubber faces, and then rupture of the material. I should point out to you that you should not just keep on going with this. If you do, it sort of gathers behind the uh, grip face and then becomes problematic. Uh, this is the type of failure uh, you're supposed to have. Uh, no grip slippage. These are rubber face grips on this uh, woven slip film. Uh, the response was uh, 248 pounds, uh, deflection was 0.5, and that corresponds into uh, 17%. So this is ASTM D as in David 4632 grab tensile strength of uh, geotextiles.